Hey, so uh, this forecast right here going to be cold here into the morning hours, but what we're doing is we are temperature watching. We're going to see exactly how cold we get out at SeaTac because if we hit the freezing point, that's going to be the first time since 2008 that we've done it in the month of April. Right now, though, I think we've been holding pretty steady at 37, so it might be a little hard to do so, but we got a couple of hours before that sun starts to rise. Uh, definitely below the freezing point, though, in Bremerton and Shelton right now. Hoquiam, we're even just a degree below, and Forks right now currently seeing those temperatures below or at the lowest temperature we've seen so far has been right around that freezing point. Now here are your current numbers. 30 in Puyallup sitting at 39 and ever so a little milder there or warmer in comparative and at 34 currently in Arlington. But overall a colder start than what we had yesterday morning and uh, that's going to be the general theme here for at least the early part of the day. The latter part of the day brings a warm up with more sunshine. Hey Tacoma, a good morning to us here and also seeing quite clear and quiet conditions in Seattle right now as we're sitting in the mid 30s. Uh, visibilities might be a little lower across areas of South Sound as we have a little more fog down that way, bringing visibilities down to a quarter of a mile in Tacoma and down to zero right now in Chehalis. So use those low beams if you're going to be traveling south along I-5. Up into the higher parts of the atmosphere, though, and nothing really to be concerned with. High pressure actually beginning to take control and has been taking control here throughout the night hour. Low pressure system is now well off to the east, and that's going to be taking all those rain chances out of here. Now, we'll keep some of that fog around early into the morning along the coast and for South Sound, but by about late uh, 8 o'clock hour, going into more than 9 o'clock hour, we'll start to see things clear out quickly, and that sunshine really does a number for us as we go on into the day. And for later on this evening, uh, since it is going to be quite nice, the Mariners back in action, lower 50s to start off the game, but it is going to cool off quickly, so bring something to cover those arms. For today, we'll top off between the low to mid 50s, depending on where you are. We do see a lot of sunshine, though, for everyone. It looks like we'll drop those numbers back down into the 30s tonight, but not quite as chilly. And for tomorrow afternoon, we're back up to around 58 degrees, but then we see a cooler stretch of weather, along with a wetter stretch of weather, too, that looks to be sticking around for us Wednesday, heading through Sunday. Adam, thanks.